What's the first thing that comes to your mind when you think about Sweden? Is it the breathtaking northern lights, the medieval charm of cobblestone streets, or the sleek modernity of cities like Stockholm? In this video, we're taking you on a journey through the top places to visit in Sweden, from the enchanting old town of Visby to the awe-inspiring landscapes of Abisko National Park. Discover the history behind the towering Uppsala Cathedral, explore the vibrant art scene in Gothenburg, and even step into the world's first ice hotel in Karuna. Did you know that Stockholm is often called the Venice of the North due to its 14 islands and numerous bridges? Join us as we uncover the best places Sweden has to offer. The last one is by far my favorite and the most beautiful, so make sure you stick around for it. The first stop on our journey is Stockholm, the capital of Sweden, is a city spread across 14 islands connected by over 50 bridges. The city's old town, Gamla Stan, is a medieval marvel with cobblestone streets, colorful buildings, and historic sites like the Royal Palace and Stockholm Cathedral. Stockholm is also home to innovative museums, such as the Vasa Museum, which houses a preserved 17th century warship. For panoramic views, head to the Ericsson Globe, Stockholm Globe Arena, or Skansen, the world's oldest open-air museum and zoo, showcasing the whole of Sweden with houses, animals, and traditions from every part of the country. Purchase a Stockholm Pass for access to many attractions and public transportation. Summer is the best time to visit for outdoor activities. Did you know that Stockholm is often called the Venice of the North due to its many waterways and islands? After soaking in the urban charm of Stockholm, let's head west to Gothenburg, where canals and seafood await in this lively port city. Gothenburg, Sweden's second largest city, is a bustling port city on the west coast known for its Dutch-style canals and vibrant art scene. The city is famous for its seafood, particularly in the Feska Korka fish market. Liseberg, one of Europe's top amusement parks, offers thrilling rides and beautiful gardens. Art lovers will appreciate the Gothenburg Museum of Art, while the Universum Science Center is perfect for families. Try the city's specialty, Gothenburg Shrimp Sandwiches. Explore the city by bike or take a paddle boat tour through the canals. Did you know that Gothenburg hosts the Gothenburg Film Festival, the largest film festival in Scandinavia? Now let's travel south to Malmo, where modern architecture meets historic charm just across the bridge from Copenhagen. Malmo is a diverse and modern city in southern Sweden, known for its blend of contemporary architecture and historic sites. The Turning Torso, a neo-futuristic skyscraper, is an iconic landmark. Malmo's old town, Gamla Staden, features charming squares, half-timbered houses, and St. Peter's Church, dating back to the 14th century. The city's proximity to Copenhagen via the Öresund Bridge makes it an ideal base for exploring both Sweden and Denmark. Take a stroll in Kungsparken, Malmö's oldest park. Don't miss the Malmö Castle, which also houses a museum. Did you know that the Turning Torso is the tallest building in the Nordic countries, standing at 190 meters? Finally, we'll wind down our Swedish adventure with a leisurely cruise along the Gota Canal. Sweden's famous Blue Ribbon of Tranquility and Engineering Marvels. The Gota Canal is one of Sweden's most famous waterways, stretching 190 kilometers from the Baltic Sea to Lake Vänern. Built in the early 19th century, the canal features 58 locks and passes through picturesque countryside, charming villages, and historic sites. Travelers can explore the canal by boat, bike, or on foot, enjoying the peaceful scenery and the engineering marvels of the locks. Book a canal cruise for a relaxing way to see the canal. Bring a picnic and stop at one of the many scenic spots along the way. Did you know that the Gota Canal is often referred to as the Blue Ribbon of Sweden 
and is considered one of the country's greatest engineering achievements. Now let's journey to the Baltic Sea and step back in time in the medieval town of Visby on the island of Gotland. Visby is a UNESCO World Heritage Site located on the island of Gotland in the Baltic Sea. This medieval town is famous for its well-preserved city walls, cobbled streets, and ancient church ruins. Every August, Visby hosts Medieval Week, a festival that transports visitors back to the Middle Ages with jousting tournaments, markets, and performances. The town's rose-adorned cottages and stunning views over the Baltic Sea make it a picturesque destination. Visit during Medieval Week for a unique experience. Rent a bike to explore the island's countryside and coastline. Did you know that Visby's city walls, known as the Ring Wall, date back to the 13th century and are one of the best preserved in Europe? Next, we leave the ancient walls behind and venture into the pristine wilderness of Abisko National Park, a paradise for nature lovers. Located in the far north, Abisko National Park is a paradise for nature lovers and adventure seekers. The park is famous for its pristine wilderness, including mountains, lakes, and valleys. Abisko is one of the best places in the world to witness the northern lights due to its clear skies and minimal light pollution. In the summer, the park is ideal for hiking, with the Kungsleden King's Trail being a popular route. Stay at the Abisko Mountain Station for easy access to trails and the Aurora Sky Station. Bring mosquito repellent in summer. Did you know that Abisko is one of the few places in Sweden where you can experience the midnight sun with 24 hours of daylight in summer? After exploring Sweden's great outdoors, we return to the heart of history and learning in Uppsala, where tradition and academia blend seamlessly. Uppsala, one of Sweden's oldest cities, is a charming university town with a rich history. The city is home to Uppsala University, founded in 1477, and the stunning Uppsala Cathedral, the largest church in Scandinavia. Uppsala is also known for the Gustavianum, a museum showcasing Viking artifacts, and the Linnaeus Garden, dedicated to the famous botanist Carl Linnaeus. The Fyrus River runs through the city, adding to its picturesque charm. Visit the Gamla Uppsala burial mounds, an important archaeological site. Take a guided tour of Uppsala University's historic buildings. Did you know that Carl Linnaeus, the father of modern taxonomy, lived and worked in Uppsala, and his house and garden are now a museum? Let's now sail to the sunny island of Oland, where history, beaches, and a unique landscape create a perfect summer getaway. Oland, Sweden's second largest island, is a popular summer destination known for its beautiful beaches, unique landscapes, and historic sites. The island is home to the ancient Borgholm Castle, Ekatorp Fortress, and the Stora Alvaret, a UNESCO World Heritage Site characterized by its limestone plateau. Oland also hosts Sweden's largest harvest festival, Skurdafesten, in the fall. Visit during the summer to enjoy the beaches and outdoor activities. Rent a car or bike to explore the island at your own pace. Oland is known as the Island of the Sun and Wind due to its sunny weather and strong winds, making it a great spot for windsurfing. Make sure to include Sweden's stunning waterfalls on your adventure list. Sweden is home to breathtaking waterfalls, and they are a must-see for any nature lover visiting the country. One of the most spectacular is Tenforsen, Sweden's largest waterfall, located near Ar in the Jämtland region. With a height of 38 meters and a width of 60 meters, Tenforsen roars into the wilderness, especially in the spring and summer when snowmelt fuels its power. Nupesker is Sweden's highest waterfall, 93 meters high with a free fall of 70 meters. The hiking trail is fairly easy, 
but not suitable for strollers or wheelchairs. The best time to visit is during early summer, when the waterfall is at its peak flow. There's a scenic path leading to a viewpoint, so don't forget your camera for those unforgettable shots. In winter, the waterfall freezes, creating an otherworldly ice formation worth braving the cold for. Did you know that during winter, Tenforsen, the largest waterfall, transforms into a frozen spectacle? And nearby, you can explore an ice hotel that forms every year with walls and furniture made entirely of ice. Ready for a change of scenery? We're heading north to Kiruna, where Arctic adventures and the magical northern lights will take your breath away. Kiruna, located in Swedish Lapland, is famous for its unique natural phenomena, including the northern lights and the midnight sun. Also, the town is home to the world's first ice hotel, built entirely of ice and snow. Visitors can sleep in ice rooms, marvel at ice sculptures, and even get married in the ice chapel. In winter, Karuna offers activities like dog sledding, snowmobiling, and reindeer safaris. Visit between December and March for the best chance to see the northern lights. Dress warmly and in layers to handle the Arctic temperatures. Did you know that the Ice Hotel is rebuilt every winter, with a new design and theme each year? And finally, let's tantalize our taste buds with the delights of traditional Sweden cuisine, which is rich with tradition, focusing on simple yet flavorful ingredients. Swedish meatballs are iconic worldwide, have been a staple in Swedish households for centuries. The lingonberry jam adds a sweet contrast to the savory meatballs, while the creamy sauce makes the dish more comforting. Traditionally served during holiday meals. Don't miss out on the cured salmon. It's a delicate dish, combining savory, salty, and herbaceous flavors, making it a popular choice for festive occasions. And finally, let's discover Swedish Buffet, a way to sample a wide variety of Swedish culinary staples. It's all about abundance and variety, an assortment of cold and warm dishes. The tradition of smorgasbord dates back to the 16th century, where guests would help themselves to appetizers before the main meal. And there you have it, the top 10 places you absolutely can't miss in Sweden. We hope this video has sparked your wanderlust and given you a taste of what makes this country so great. If you enjoyed the journey, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your fellow travelers, and subscribe to our channel for more adventures around the world. Let us know in the comments which Sweden destination is on your bucket list, or share your own travel tips. Remember, travel is not just about the destinations, but also the memories you create along the way. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.